Okay, so there's a reason why Stark Drones didn't upload a lot of content for a very long time, and that's because Stark Drones has a lot of updates, especially in regards to software restructuring and more. So first off, there's the Stark Global Initiative. There's IP and hardware status, the Dare to Dream collection, the Aspiring Astronaut Journey that I want to talk about, the Cloud Contracts ecosystem, StartHub Messenger relaunch, BitBazis, Heads Pocket development update, and Digital CPR.VC and Founder Side projects. The content in this presentation is for informational purposes only. Stark Drones contributes to the development of various software as an overseer most of the time, and lots of said software products could even be separate entities. This is the same when overseeing the development of open source tech. Stark Drones is primarily a hardware and R&D company. None of the information displayed in this presentation is meant to be taken as investment advice or solicitation for an investment. Do your own due diligence and research. So the Stark, Dro the Stark Global Initiative. So, so far in regards to the Stark Global Initiative, What's been finished is the official incorporation of the Stark Global Initiative, which was on February 28, 2023. The Stark Global Initiative is a sub-entity of Stark Drones, and the logo and branding is in place. It wants to be a non-profit initiative and sub-entity for a lot of the social good and charitable work that Stark Drones does for tax purposes, sponsorship opportunities, war grants, and things of that nature. Um, in regards to to-do, there is the accounting setup, integrate um, nonprofit CRM subscription, which we currently have Apollo, full charitable trust filing, potential volunteer mats account, potential, and then um, other things that are potentially on the to-do list, again, all of this is potentially, right, is to apply for the Google for Nonprofits, work on a social impact plan, project launches, charity navigator profile, and the Stark Global Initiative wants to cover um, its language transcription projects, water harvesting for less developed countries, various nonprofit impact projects, and the hub between Egypt, Israel, and Syria. And then also another project is the development of a blockchain infrastructure project that is in the works. It's called Starkchain. The website is starkchain.dev. And it's also a sub page in the Stark Drones website. And Stark Drones is also potentially competing in various X prizes, which is the Carbon Removal X Prize as well as the Wildfires one. We will um, know for sure if we're actually going to compete um, more on a later timeline, but that's currently potentially the plan right now. And then in regards to the IP and hardware status, there are six patents that are pending or registered in one trademark. And one of the patents was already approved and granted. Actively, um, a lot of the applications and IP, IP applications and whatnot, whether patents or trademarks or whatnot, is um, being maintained. The Dare to Dream um, collection is uh, in the works NFT memberships collection that we might um, integrate for um, tracking um, premium content and stuff like that for the Aspiring Astronaut Journey project as well as for other things. I mean, we're not fully sure on like how we're going to fully distribute this and all the details just yet, but this is something that as a memberships NFT, something that Star Drones might be working on. Again, it's a utility, by the way. 
that said, the aspiring astronaut Cerny um, wants to be a documentary series about me, potentially um, some of the sports things I'm doing, like training and whatnot, um, as well as potentially getting a pilot's license and stuff like that. But basically, take a, a, take all these um, snippets and potentially, if funding allows, make documentaries and mini series off of those. And that's another thing that Star Drones wants to work on that's really cool. More details could be coming in the future. The cloud contracts ecosystem. So the cloud contracts project have actively been maintained recently. It has it has new pairs. Um, sorry for that typo. It has new pairs on TuckPy. USDC has been activated, and it has been added to Exazix, TXBit, and DX Trade, and has a new statistics dashboard. It also has various DAP applications. Stuff is work in progress. Please consider this experimental. We aren't soliciting financial advice. Any actions you decide to do are fully at your own risk. Cloud contracts is meant to be looked at as a utility. And then another project that's sort of in the works is a potential relaunch for the StartHub Messenger application. A landing page have already been done and we've been upgrading the back end and are slowly working on potentially releasing beta to a large variety of users. And then BitBadzes, a lot of updates to repos, um, a new um, website design entirely, bitbadzes.org is the URL and a lot of projects that are in the work before the beta launch release. Heads Pocket development update. So Heads Pocket is a work in progress and may or may not be released depending on deployment schedule. Right now, the main goal is to see what we can do from a code base perspective and what users want to see for beta and or post beta. And then there's also various different projects. So Sansor's The Iron Soldier is a side project for a really important movie concept. Stark Drones might be actually doing um, a lot of stuff in regards to drone photography as well as potentially be a vendor for that movie if it's going to be made in, as well as work as like in props and stuff like that. There's also um, the digitalcpr.vc landing page, and there's a bunch of other projects and concepts that I want to see if I could integrate within the Stark Drones deployment pipeline or within the ecosystem. Thank you for watching, and that sums up all our current updates and why Stark Drones have sort of been MIA for a while.